think we are? Ride a horse again. Oh, hey. Hey there, fella. Is that a white horse up there? Is that him again? That's him again. Jesus Christ. We can't get enough of you, huh? Well, I wish I... Oh, shit. How did you should let me shoot his horse? Then he be down there tending it. Well, well, if you shot my horse, I would have had to try to shoot him back. Well, no, you would have been the shot then. Well, yeah, that's why I said I'm glad you didn't shoot the horse. Please keep no attention to that man. He is a moron. Well, Excuse me, I'm not a moron. Listen, you've been jabbering off to folks about us. Uh, how so? Well, we last saw you over in Tumbleweed. You talked to anybody since then? I was playing the piano in Armadillo, hoping to uh, see if anybody would come by. Yeah, boss, he's not the snitching type. Most of the guys around here are incompetent to listen. Well, yeah, I'll be honest, uh... All the people I tell about this stuff is like other marshals or law enforcement, and sadly, you're looking at the only marshal around right now, it seems, so. Right. Well, how about you spin around, head back to Armadillo, keep trying out that piano? Yeah, well, uh, sadly, I don't think piano's my style. I don't think it worked out too well. I'm at a different uh, black lauder. Then play until it is your style. Well, are you guys, where are you guys headed now? Somewhere else. What's Not Blackwater? God damn it, I say slap this man. Give him a slap, he asks too many questions. Give him a nice slap. What can? What? You, you just give me the guy that asked about Armadillo or me? <laughs> you always ask too many I mean, questions about when the goddamn too short. Got him. Oh, he hit me back. Oh, <laughs> I didn't realize that. <laughs> oh, shit. Hit me back? Jesus Christ. Well, if you want to smack him so bad, go smack him, old timer. Oh, I did I'm smack him. Smack this guy do, you, do you want to have a fist fight or something? If you hit me back, I'll put a knife in you. Get off so I can slap him around the face fast and too many damn questions. Oh, there he goes. Now that'll get him down. Hey, no, hey. boss, don't hurt the horse. Take it easy. He's got a gun in his holster. Watch out, boss. Yeah, I'm watching him. You ever have a slap off? Make it quick. That guy again, it's guns blazing. Don't wait, I shoot.
Well, we still need to make our way to Hansburg. We could stop by the Emerald Ranch. Could be a school there. Black see, if our, see if our ranch and friend is still around? Uh, perhaps. I don't know. It seems a little close. I want to hit something north of San Denis, probably. All right. Maybe something along the Van Horn. I'm considering it. They don't have enough money. They'll turn into money for us. Hey, we can put everybody up in that, that wagon? Yeah. Actually, yeah, it's not a bad idea. That, I'd like to ride around in that. Hey, stop that wagon. Yeah. Boy, I'm falling asleep. I don't care about your cock. I'm sure no one does. But uh, keep it to yourself. Oh, you're the one that brought it up? You're right, and I apologize. Pea shooters are uh, yours to deal with, not mine. Oh, I get it. Pea shooter, because I shoot pee out of it. Alright, go find me, Brian, up the cage. See if he's around. Why, I do think we've arrived at our destination, my gentlemen friends. How about we go Fuck and off. begin our wicked work? We are here for the ball. Why, well, what's the matter with you?
see all the gold? No, you're supposed to be finding me, Brian. Well, I couldn't find him. I searched all in the mines. He even, even got me an arm mining hat. I see that. It's actually kind of cool. Thanks, hey, fellas. Oi. Oh, it's, uh, it's a mining head. Whatever. Hey, I found a little interesting room. Might want to look at this. Could be useful to us. Oi. It's gonna fight oh. here. Blood trail leading out of town. All right. It happens. But none of Looks you like found north. Uh, our buyer. He's not here. Am I in a gang of midgets? What do you mean? I mean, look at this. Look, at, look all around me. Yeah, it Mate, looks so that way. fucking sorry, I'm short. Let me just fix that for you. Well, our guy's not here. Alright. Got any of those nuggets, boss? Sure do. You can offload them at the post office. Where's about? Like right here? Right boy behind. Here. Right behind. Boy, boy, boys. Hey, boy, it here. Say, ow. Take a look at this. Come on. Real nice scene right here. So, imagine some of the locals don't uh, actually live in these houses. They're empty. Yeah, this one right here. Look at that. Nice little room for an interrogation of sorts. Close the door. Have your way with the fella. Yeah, like it. And a good place to hide out when yeah. the law comes. This next one open. Bam. There's a couple on the other side of the street, but... It is what it is. Mate. I know what I'm doing. Don't drink that water. What was it going to? You're going to drink it, I saw you. You got any apples? Yeah. Can I have one? Nope. Why? You're going to eat them. Just give them one at a yeah, time. Yeah, of course. That's what the fucking apples are for, isn't it? One at a time, you know, ration them yeah. out. You know where the minor shop is? I dropped about 15 up there. It's like a bar shovel. What? You're I lying. need some apples. Nope. I'll go up there. You want to see something I found? No. Nope. Follow me. Good fans. It's a regular detective. Hi, right, boys. All right, so check it. It starts here, right? It fucking goes in here. It's got a bandage. Then it heads back out. Follow me. Uh, well, come on, keep up, cunt. What the fuck is this place? Right come on, keep up. He went this way. Right? More footprints here. He comes over here. Right? Has another bandage. See? Yeah. He fucking heads out this way. Okay. And he heads out of town north. Oh, shit. Ain't think about this. Why would someone get in a fight in a fucking mining town? Because he found fucking gold, mate. Right, he's got bad. his gold and he's heading north. Good job. Only kid. one fucking road up there, mate. So why don't we fucking follow it and take his shit? It's not a bad idea, kid. Not a bad All idea. right, but you gotta tell the boss because he fucking hates me. Uh, present yeah, it as your own, mate. Say that you found it. He doesn't hate you. No, mate, I'm telling you, present the idea as your own and he'll fucking do it. But if I fucking say it, he'll call me a moron and say, we ain't got time to chase the, the, the blood. You tell him, mate. Why'd you think he hates you? I don't know, mate. Fucking everything he does. He's just an angry man. That's all. Yeah, well, he ain't an angry man to you, mate. So why don't you fucking tell him about the footprints? You're kidding me. He brought in a gun at me earlier because I knocked him with a horse. Yeah, well, you're kind of a knobhead, aren't you? What do you call me? I didn't say anything, mate. I coughed. Listen, you present it as your own, he'll fucking do it. 
Guaranteed. Do you hear somebody vomit? 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 vomit vom disgusting. Puking? Might fucking clean up. Hey, <clears throat> let's hurry up. I gotta get some medical care because that dumbass Maurice. Poor, how much money? All right, get your cut, old man. Oh, Boy, were there any ciggies in the uh? Might be some of the saloon, mate. I oh, already got it. Boy, let's go. Already got your cut. Maurice, kid, come here. Kid found something. Tell him what you found, kid. Some tracks heading north, mate, after a fight. I bet he's got gold on him. Because why else would he get into a fucking fight in a mining town? Might be old, though. Oh, yeah, how fresh were it, though? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. Listen, I need to get myself some more ammo. I'll be at the I store, and then we're going to ride mate, out. Considering what the blood's still wet. You need? Revolver. Come here. I didn't mean to burst the kid's bubble, but, uh, nobody mines gold. Everybody pans it. So, it's likely we... Yeah, this is for copper. Gold here. No, you don't strike gold here. You get iron or zinc But you or could, copper. mate. You fucking could. No, you could It's couldn't. a fucking mine, innit? You don't get gold from every mine, genius. Right, but you Not could every have fucking found a gold it, mine. You? All right, pile in, children. Alfred, you still riding up front? Yeah, give me, give me Alfred oh. on top. I was going to tell you off again on accident. All right, where are these tracks? God damn, it's hard to see out here. Ooh, looks like they could use a light eye patch. Well, I would be outside, but I, told, I was told to get inside by the boss because I bear a big, you know, red coat. Well, yeah, I didn't want shiny light hair and fucking red coat right on the top. Your time will come, I patch. Don't worry. Well, How long you want me traveling around on this before we give up? Work out. They 
think I'm just some bystander. Don't really do much. And Maurice is relatively new. Maybe it'll work out. Oh, but he does have a red bandana. I bet they want to talk to him. Oh, I reckon that's black water I can see from here. You think so? What? Say, boss, what about doing a score at Valentine? Something quick. Yeah, what you got in mind? Grab someone. Take him all the way out here. A snatch and grab. How are we gonna do that without a scene? Hmm. Maybe get someone on the way in. This thing posted up. Make it look broken down. Get our horses ready from the late nearby stables and uh, make something happen. Maybe. We'll keep it in the cards, all right? Sure. Me and Valentine are pretty busy town. Busy enough on the inside. No one will see anything happening on the outside. They've got their own trials and tribulations. Their own woes and worries. They won't see us. Thank you, boss. What do you know? I know all about some things. Yeah, which things? The stuff and things. Which stuff? Oh, you know, the things that are stuffs. All right. Important stuffs. Say, all right. Patch, here's an interesting one. Could you tell us about uh, shutting the fuck up for a second? What do you know about that? Well, I know that, uh... Maurice has finally done it. <laughs> <laughs> they were right. I'm damn right. I guess you do know things. Yeah, right? I guess he does. You know, I take it back. Well, we could Sorry. Do we could uh, make someone sit in the back of this and cops on them. That way we can keep someone hostage without them being obviously hostage. I mean, we could offer just to give someone a ride and get them in the carriage. That's true. Well, I, got a, I got an idea. What if someone runs into town and wants to tell everybody about their cart down by the river that they live in? What? what do you they live in a cart down by the river. Oh, mm, I think we only want one person. Yeah, I we don't want to tell everybody. The, the problem with the... Uh, Telling people or showing people we're in this carriage that it blows our cover. It doesn't do us any favors anymore. Well, I reckon it would just be one person saying that it's their home. Yeah, I get it. I get it. It's an old story. We're gonna ride for the Cumberland Falls, I reckon. Damn it, get out of the way. You ever heard the legend, dog? The filth. That's a myth. I've seen it. Oh, now you're talking about deep in the swamp with the bayou. Said there's a man, there's a baby that was thrown out into the swamp. Legend has it. The gators, they raised them as one of their own. The gators? That's right. The gators are gonna eat a little baby if it's yeah, in the swamp. Yeah, there ain't no way a baby surviving out of the I'm swamp. I'm telling you, I've seen it. I was riding through there and I saw eyes looking back at me. The sound of a baby crying. Could have been anything. Probably a bird. Ain't no way it's to feel. I know when I feel in my bones. It's probably just frogs. So wait, you believe that gators raised a man as one of their own in the swamp, and now that man is called the filth, and he looks at you at certain times in the swamp. Oh, he cries like a baby. Oh, he still cries like a baby, even though Why he's a grown he man now. Why does he still cry like a baby? Yeah, wait, he's still a baby? That ain't that much of a threat. He's a man. He's a man. He's a man, baby? He's a baby but man. He's, he's he a big baby. He didn't have a baby. childhood as we crying out for one. God damn it, I've seen it, I'm telling you. Oh, no, how about he, all that. How would he understand the concept of a childhood if he never had one? God damn it. An alligator child. Yeah, I don't think he'd be missing something that he never had. I believe in ghosts. Sadie, eat your toes and your fingers first. That way you can't grab them. Well, we 
Which one? Your toes or your fingers? I don't know. I didn't get close enough to tell. How do you tell by getting close enough? Yeah, what he's... I mean, who told you that? Just the word on the wall. Word on the wall. So a sign? There's a sign that says this? Where's the sign oh, at? Oh, David, there's a metaphor. All right. I reckon this is a good spot to actually do the deed here. Oh, good. I've been having to poop for a while, boss. I don't think people come back that often, don't they? Well, that's the point. We're going to bring someone from Valentine out this way. Ain't we? We'll get out oh. and stretch my legs, if you don't mind. Oi! Does anyone have an apple? I'm a bit hungry. Uh, none on me. Yeah. Come on, get, I have one. I have you one. You can get some in town when you and uh, Larry go in. Oh, look, there's a red coat over here on the on the wash rack. Right, Larry, you ready? You need me to carry you, mate. I can. I'm good for it. So France, was it? What part? I won't laugh at you. No jokes, mate. No, come on. It was it was just for fun, mate. Come on. Trust me, a laugh from you means nothing to me. Then you got no reason not to tell me, mate. Come on. What part of France? Oh, because that's not the reason doesn't mean I have no reason. Anyway, mate, you were telling me what part of France you're from. Why, why are you so curious, kid? I just want to know more about you, mate. You wear an eye patch, yet you say you haven't lost an eye. So I'm curious. Why are you trying to hide it, mate? Anyway, no. let's start. Let's start young. Where were you? Where are you from, mate? France. I don't need this right now, kid. There's a lot of things we don't need, mate. All a man needs is food, drink, and a fucking shelter, mate. But the banter is what makes life worth none. living. So come on. Kid. What about you? What's your family like apart from your sister? Was it parents? Well, I was born at the age of zero, right? And I fucking grew up streets of London, mate. Fucking had no one. You know, travel all around the whole island. You know, to the other fucking cities. Uh, Bristol. Brighton. You got London. Stupid. You said Brighton just fine last time. Right, right, right. Um, Liverpool. Birmingham. Corn Cornwall, That's Essex. Not That's not a city either. Manchester. Right. And you know, we fucking, we went everywhere, right? And then, you know, fucking, we that joined is... up with the dogs. We went back home for a bit whenever things got fucking rowdy, right? But we went back home for a bit, fucking back to... Pe Nor Norwick. Norwick. Ah, yes. Right. Fucking Isle of Man, you know the whole fucking nine. We went everywhere, Isle been up and man. down, the right? Isle of man. Right, and then we fucking came back, right? We had the fucking dogs are back, or whatever, right? And so here we fucking right. are, mate. Fucking boat to Chicago, and here we are, left, wow. right, and fucking center. Well, that's uh, quite the story, Maurice. Where'd you want this gang to end up? What's that? Where'd you want all of this to end up? What's your end blame? Well, you know I ain't think about that much, but... You know, once we've made our score, maybe we could head to a tropical island and farm some papayas, just like we talked about. God damn it. You always talk about that. We go to Watiti and farm papayas. Told you there ain't no place called goddamn Watiti. It sure is. <coughs> you think we'll make it that far? Nope. <laughs> if I'm being honest, I think we, uh... I think the best we can do is make a lot of money and split our own different ways. Just like we did before. Yeah. We know what happened before. I'm sure. The job in San Denis went bad. Tried to rob that bank. Real bad. Well. New crew. Well, mostly. Yep. 
They don't know what we've seen. They soon will. You just told me places. Right, mate, but I fucking imply we didn't have much family, did we? Because we fucking traveled. Yeah, you said you were born at the age of zero to who? Mother, father, yeah, my fucking, mother. Well, my fucking dad didn't shit me out, mate. Is your father dead? Do you remember him? No, mate, died when I was young. Shame. Sad story. You say same or shame? Shame. It is, isn't it? Well, and me mom, bless so her heart, uh, exploded. Mm -hmm. What kind of explosion? Industrial, mate. She was a fucking factory worker. Somebody poured the fucking water in the molten iron and fucking blew her ass up. Fucking bit of mom here, bit of mom there, fucking everywhere, mate. You had to fucking hose her off the walls. And were you in the factory as well? What, sweeping the chimney, maybe? No, mate, I was at home. It was my fucking day off. Me sis, though, caught a full fucking eye on mom going, take an eyeball landed on her shoulder, mate. Wow, she's lucky she doesn't wear an eye patch. Funny, mate, it's me fucking mom you're talking about. My fucking eye you talking about. Grow up. Yeah, well, eye for an eye, right? I suppose so, except I have mine. You wanna know why I wear the patch or what my family's like? Pick. Let's go with family. Right? Family, uncles, and maybe even doctor and books. How about you there, uh, I patch? What's your end goal? What do you mean? Oh, uh, well, when we get enough money, what you gonna do? Enough money? How much is enough? That's what I'm thinking. I'll we'll take a bath in this little tub. It's me, size. Wash my feet off. I don't know how much enough is. I guess it reckons how much is enough. Let's say you get $2,000. What you gonna do with it? Oh, I reckon I'm gonna spend it for the gang. Oh, it's some good horses. Yeah, that's some good horse money. Let's say you get twenty thousand dollars. That's more than anyone could spend in a lifetime. Mm -hmm. Boy, that's a lot of money. You do it for the money. What do you mean? More of this. You do it for the money. I don't reckon I do. Did you do it because you enjoy killing? Oh, I don't know about that. That's why you do I it. I do it because I enjoy the company. You get plenty of company. And the Scarlet Dog the saved my life, they did. So you do it because you're loyal. Oi. Fair enough. My grandmother. You said Navy, right? France Navy? Yeah, the French Navy. What's that like? You should know about that. Real enemies of yours, the days of old. Yeah, well, it's all the same in it. We bleed the same color. I suppose so. Oh, what is that that you're playing? Yeah, a fiddle? I don't have a name for it. Oh, no, mandolin. Oh. My father was getting money while my uncle looked after me and uh, grandma. When he could, of course. The rest came down to me. Right. I ended up here looking for a new life and some stories to tell when I go back home one day. But I doubt I'll make it. Why is that, mate? Ah, uh, well, let's just say dying young seems to run in the family. Chin up, mate. We're not fucking dead yet. I only took one bullet today. I'm not looking to make it another, right? Well, I've took several. Yeah, haven't we fucking all, but I'm just counting today. What you want us to uh, do with your body if you die? I bet. What do you mean? What if you die? Oh, what yeah, I'm buried. It's in with to my wife and kids. You have a wife and kids? Oi. Should we well, take off our jackets man. and leave them in, out, out of town? That's a good idea. Alright, let's put him in this bush. You need a bandana if you're gonna 
afford to. Why'd you leave him? Oi, and help the gang. Oh, shit, I didn't know that. Well, I got two little ones. What's the names? Oh, it's Susan and Billy. <clears throat> the fake name you gave earlier was your son. Oh, I didn't even make up the fake name. That was someone else. They just pulled it out perfect. Forcefully get someone to come with us. Oh right, I forgot but, the fucking. What about a doctor? You know they've got yeah, fucking coin, right? First. Wait, you want to bring the doctor? Yeah, I might say like, oh, we, because you know I've got a fucking bully. Mate. It's gonna be fucking right suspect. So we'd be like, all right, mate, we fucking mates also got fucked. No, we don't want the doctor. The town needs a doctor. They'll uh be notified if he goes missing. Bring anyone else. Right. Am I going to be the one luring him, or are you? We'll see what happens. I'll be around you, so we won't do right. anything without He's the other He's in a pod. Sure. But we'll get seen first ourselves, and then we do the job. Right, right. Who are you thinking, a sheriff? Mm, a sheriff would make sense, but uh, it'd be a little risky right now. I don't think they'd come one at a time either. Probably in a group. Yeah, probably a pot in the sauce. Dexy William, but we all call him Billy. How old are they? I reckon they'd be close to ten by now, both of them. When was the last time we saw them? It's been years. Three or four. That's what you do with your money. You see him again. I'll give it to them. Yeah. This is the shittest town in the area. I can tell that, mate. It fucking smells yeah, like shite. Yeah. Like flies. The shit that is the town. It's got a saloon. Yeah. Is it nice? Don't know. My wife, Lily. It's a lovely name. How about you, I boss? saw a doll. I saw a doll in the, uh, in the, in the store in Rhodes. And Is I thought right? of him. I started to get a little tear in my eye. Some fella came in and started laughing at me because I had a tear in my eye. I almost shot him. And nothing bad about crime. If someone does happen to recognize us, mate, what's the move? Well, watch your gun. Steal a horse. Middle of town, pull a gun. We'd be liable to be well, fucking dead, honestly. You wanna surrender? Go ahead. Well, mate, I'm saying we fucking run and we have a meetup spot, like behind a house or something, where we can ambush if shit goes down. Just you and me? And yeah, mate. Right? Just do what we gotta fucking do, you know? And that's the scene at a doctor right now. Hello, hello, hello? Anyone home? A piss. Why not cry? What? Well, it's all liquid coming at your body anyway, right? I mean, that that just don't make sense. No, I don't, I don't agree with that. Ain't no goddamn poet. How about you, Yo, little deer's boss? running down us. What about me? Got any family? Nope. Uh, we have family now, boss. That's right, boys. Mighty fine to have you around, too. Check the saloon, mate. Maybe buy some whiskey. Yeah, maybe some cigarettes. Mighty fine to be here. I miss New York, though. Yeah, why's that? It's a nice place. Not from what I've heard. A lot of business there. Streets are busy. Too many buildings. Oi. A lot of buildings going up. Tall ones. Not too tall, though. It's a three-story building. 
，我是 m a 哎，哇、哦，我的 s t e e l Yeah, it is actually. Hello, hello, hello. A lot of things you can do with three stories. Tell me a war story, old timer. All right. One time, you, me, and the boys, we got a little bit lost. Can you believe that? We weren't following the trail properly. Four of us. Two of them. Kids four of you. That's right. You went out in groups of four during the war? No, no, no. We were a group of twelve of us at first.
do this, Pawnhead. Oh no, it'll just be you, me, and your friend here. I don't want to give you the wrong well, idea. Okay. So we got a deal? He's just a kid. I don't know. Mate, why are you got a fucking he's gun? The one that took my the one that took my shotgun. Which one? Uh, well, I'm thinking I can't fat boy remember. Small. I think it's whoa. What? He's not no, fat. The, He's big bone. <laughs> the the smaller person. No, Mike. I'm not sure. It's small in what regard? Stature. Shut up. Pondhead. Yes. Just be honest with me. Was he there? Yeah. Sure, it's, uh, he was there. He didn't take it. Oh, I don't know if he took it. Off you, it wasn't him. Okay, but kidding. you understand. You, I understand You'll take me back. to the person who did that? Chicken. I'm a little thirsty. I bet you know it's about New York. What's so fancy oh. about it? Oh, there's stores everywhere. Everybody uh, has a store. Lots to buy, lots to sell. All the little street urchins, too. Stealing from everyone. I don't know. Everybody's on the up and up there now. Mm. It's all about business. Everybody's on the up and up, but you decided to leave, come out here and do some banditing? Well, gang saved my life. So I stuck with the gang. You know what? Not really. I'd like for you to have your gun and have a nice day. You've been harassed enough. I really hate to see you get more harassed. But the way things are going, so you have a bit of vendetta. How'd you get that scar, Ross? This scar? Damn. Well, I was down over in New Austin area, right about south near Rio Del Lobo Rock. I'm sticking up a f couple of fools here. It was um, a father, his young daughter, and his wife. What were the names? I didn't much catch them on account of us robbing them. I think the daughter was Susanna because the mom cried out for her to run, but the boys and I rounded them up, corralled them back into the road. Well, you see, the mother was just trying to protect this young daughter. Wait, 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 wait. Before we continue, Scarlet Dogs of the Red Bandanas. Yeah. Wait, mate, hang on. Give me a I bit. Know it's the Scarlet Dogs. Let me finish this. Maurice, I'm not going to go that way. Relax. I'm just saying before Are we fucking head out, mate. Before we shoot? We're no. shooting? No. I thought we were heading out. We're gonna walk. I'm so tired of that song. But the man, he was trying to protect his whole family and he had a piece. So he reached for it and I stopped his arm, but with his other, he went for his knife. Hang on, mate. Listen, what's going on? We can work this out. What's going on? We're gonna work this out. Larry. What's going on? Please, Marshall, don't drop that gun when he finishes smoking. Wait, I'm not gonna Marshall. fucking pull a gun, mate. Why would I'm I do that? I understand he's smoking. I'm not gonna... Mate, I'm fucking smoking. Gonna what's going on, mate? What are we doing? Thank you, guys. Marshall, Deputy no Marshall, what happened to Taylor. Went for the eyes, he did, but caught him in time before it caused too much trouble. You listening? I need to know you're listening right now. Maurice. Please. Oh, you? I thought you were talking about him. Maurice. What? Please. Run. Of course, then I had to put a bolt in him right in front of his family. Hey, Larry. Well, 
We sent that daughter on head the way up north on the trail and left the father in a Don't ditch. Don't do it, mate. Or did you kill the rest of the family? Did you let him go? Let him go. Do you want me to keep playing? That's all right. You know what? I'll play some. You want to know about the truth about the war, boys? Sure. A lot of waiting around. A lot of death. And a lot of waiting around. That sounds like banditing to me. Yeah. I was there at the uh, siege of Vicksburg. Forty days. God damn. Spent most of the time digging. Digging holes. Waiting, watching, starving now. Right. And then That's happened? pretty much all my stores. Eventually they surrendered. That's about that. So you dug some holes and they gave up? A few shots here and there. So a few men get pelted. Must never send forward to get too close. Didn't even see the fort. Probably anyone. My folks are just watching the roads. Spent about 40 days in a hole. You in there. The thing about the war is, yeah, most of the ones who survive, they're the ones who don't have many stores. I reckon. <clears throat> Alright, mm. let's back up. Boy, he's going right into town. Something like that. Crack him out of jail if we have to. All right. Hop in the back. I'll sit in the back. Tell me up front or in the back. Uh, let's get you in the back as well. Boy, that's a nice gun. Hey, don't pawn that thing of me. I'm not. I'm pointing it there. Just keep Let's looking at the man. Boy. You're pointing at me right now. Oh, I'm not pointing it at you. I'm pointing mine at you. I'm not. I'm looking out the window. All right, shut yeah, up. Now I'm pointing it at Boys. you. Fucking hell. Boy, shut the hell up. We ain't seen him anywhere on this entire stretch of road between us and Valentine. Something must have gone wrong. Oh, yes. Maybe they just got drunk at the bar or something. They don't seem the type. Oh, I have an idea. I aim out your window, you aim out mine. I have a better viewpoint that way. I can't see to the far left. I can only see out the main window. What are we doing if uh, we run into trouble, boss? What's the fallback? Well, don't forget trumpet is the uh, shoot everything and run. All right. The code word for we're going to try and hold them up will be... Hmm. I don't know. What about uh, meeting back at the oil fields if things go south? No, uh, we're going to meet at the boat, the boat if things go south. All right. But Trump I was just thinking shoot. somewhere closer. Uh, and that mandolin. Mandolin means hold him up. Hop out of the carriage and hold him up. Kind of deal. You hear me, boss? Yep. Yeah. I'm whispering yeah, normally quiet. Alright, I'm whispering too. Can you 
you hear me, boss? Yep. All right. and it is One was carrying. Yeah, you nothing. That was, that was a deputy as well. Right there. All right, we're gonna pull up to this house up in front of us. One of you is gonna have to sneak up to that jail, try to whisper in, and see if our boys are inside. Well. well, I ain't very inconspicuous, boss. Yeah, that old old man. Just like a tomato, yeah. I am. I really don't want to let's shoot talk. another person. I just shot Oof. one what person, you, you shot understand? Person? Well, <laughs> what the heck? Wait, what? How many boys? Oh, we got another one. We got another one.
party partner? <laughs> what happened? Where's the rest? There is no rest. Not anymore. That uppity deputy we ran into. Found you guys south of us in Valentine. Sim Yahoo we ran into in the building. Right there in the saloon, the asshole walks right in as we're getting drinks. I talked too much. I got Maurice killed. Maurice is dead. He's dead. Guessing the boss and eye patch. We came back looking for you, boss. Into the town? That's right. We rode in quiet yeah. like they didn't see us. I went around the back. I looked through the bars. See if you were captured. As I was looking, oh, shit. I turned around and I see that deputy. The one we ran into. Yep, same bullshitter. I began walking on. And he walks beside me saying, well, well, well. well. Put up a gun, I point at him. He points his gun at me. We're talking back and forth, saying, hey, you better not drop that, and etc., etc. And suddenly, I don't know where the boss rides a goddamn carriage straight into his back. I put two bullets on him. He grazes my arm with a bullet. I point him down. Then suddenly, all of them come around the corner. The boss is trying to turn the carriage. Gunfight and shoes, hop off. Fire a couple, rush into the saloon. I swim back around and look through my binos. They've got... They got action, Chapman. They got our patch. I think I saw the boss fall Fuck. off just before I got off. Fuck, Alfred. I'm sorry. We took too fucking long. It's all my fault. It ain't your fault. It's where you want this game to end up. What's that? Where'd you want all of this to end up? What's your end blame? In town, how might be right after us? When? What I, Alfred, give me a hand with this. One up, Tom. They're gonna be forming a posse for us. I'll be honest. Don't move. Sir, hey, okay. I don't want to shoot. Both on each other. If you just saw what I had to put through, get three fucking people. What I just had to go through. Here's a round of Bart. Bart. For Bart. Hold. For Bart. For Bart. But you're going down! You got me. Come in, boys. Maybe we're gonna head to a tropical island and farm some papayas, just like we talked about. I bet you. What do you mean? What if you die? Don't oh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, send word to my wife and kids. You have a wife and kids? Oi. In New York. Oh, yeah, do. I told the deputy we won't shoot. Because frankly, his friend's got a gun pointed at me. If I holster or unholster, whatever, I'm fucking gone. So I tell Maurice, run. We make it, book it perfectly. There's the guy's horse, white stallion right there. I recognized it along the way. I get on the horse. I feel Maurice hop on behind me, but he falls off. I start riding hard. The moment, the moment I realize he's off, I turn around, I drop the horse and I get back. By that time, shooting's already gone off. Maurice is on the ground. I fire off a shot and then head for the bushes. They didn't see me, so they thought I was on the horse. Horse keeps riding, I lose him. I went back to the meeting spot where the carriage was because I wanted to warn you guys that they might be coming. But I guess I fucked up. You didn't fuck up. We went back to find out what happened. These things happen. It took too fucking long, that's what happened. No, I won't shit. Fuck. Don't blame yourself. You ain't the one that shot them, you ain't the one that put them in the ground. You're right. It's a goddamn God damn old deputy. man. And that deputy, he's gonna have what's coming to him. Next I time. didn't get him. We are going to. Now it's damn straight. Mary? Yeah. 
And then we start doing things the way you said. Hostages. At first, once we get their sister back, I said we ride it to town in a day or two. And we set fire to the whole fucking town. Damn straight, old man. Those fucking primrose assholes have it coming. Damn right. Especially that bitchy bar woman. Fucking cockney, uh, more English bastards all over the shop. Twenty English bastards. But she took a lot of our time. She goes down with the city. Valentine. Valentine Burns. Valentine Burns. Well, at least now, it's your first official plan, boss. Well, get a few troops. We get them on up. We ride through Valentine. And then we sit fire and every land in there. We shoot down any of the deputies we take some of them hostage. We make their town pay. More ways than one. Besides, Damn straight. Moss is dead. His sister's got one revenge. We'll give it to her. And now, also, 30% of all earnings and a large cut coming from my half will be going towards Action Chaplain's family. Do you understand? Uh, yeah, sure. Wife and kid. Damn. He really was an accountant. That's right. Well, oh, shit, boss. This is it, huh? This is it. Welcome to be the right hand. Man. I'll do my best. For, for them, for Maurice, everyone. For them. Fuck the law. Who brought down Maurice? Was it a deputy? I believe it was the deputy. He shot his Primrose uh, buddy Woody or something like that. Good shot. Uh, that fucking deputy whatever. Tenacious bastard. We're gonna capture him. We're gonna give him to be. She can do whatever the fuck she wants with him. Hell yeah. Right. Time to get some rest. Yeah, boss. Rest up. <laughs>